Hey guys, welcome back to Pick Skin and Poetry. I'm Coach Hernser, here with another music reaction for you. I recently did a reaction uh, for Greta Van Fleet for their first track off the new album Starcatcher called uh, Fate of the Faithful. Um, really ended up liking that uh, song. Uh, you can check out that reaction right there if you haven't seen it. And I didn't know whether I was going to do the whole album or not. Um, I got some comments from some people that said, yeah, go ahead, do the whole album. So I'm here with the second track. Uh, this one's called Waited All Your Life. Really excited to see where this one goes. Uh, as you can tell, I'm a pretty big Led Zeppelin fan. I talked about how in the last reaction, I thought they needed to sound a little more like Led Zeppelin. I know people think, oh, that's an unfair comparison. No, I don't think so. I think Led Zeppelin's, that's my second favorite band of all time. I think they have a great sound. A lot of people don't sound like them anymore. And I think it's a good thing if Greta Van Fleet kind of leans back into that a little bit. So I thought the last song kind of leaned back that direction, which I think is a good thing. Let's see if this second song goes that direction or if it goes somewhere completely new. Kind of excited to see. Let's check it out. I'm assuming that's the pre-chorus right there really digging that part of the song i like that little sort of like um you know i'm not sure i'm not a music theory kind of person so i don't know the time signature there but i just like how the tempo kind of changed there right there in that pre-chorus um again just like you know like i said i'm not a, a music theory you know genius or any of that kind of stuff or any kind of genius for that matter <laughs> but uh i just like you know i can tell when my ear likes something and i like that little tempo change there to me that does it for me um that's the kind of stuff i like in a song um i like the ac acoustic part you know i thought this might be more of like a ballady kind of song um like what was that song off the last album was it flower power or something like that uh you know, you kind of had that kind of sound. I thought we might be going in that direction here. But yeah, I really like where this song is uh, headed after that intro. Um, let's continue, see where it goes. I'll do some lyric breakdown uh, at the end of the video. We'll do a whole little lyric breakdown. Let's keep going. Listen to the music. say real quick uh i do think I, I i might even like this song more than the first one um i like the sort of alteration here between the acoustic part and the electric and you know sort of how those are blended together I, i'm liking this song a lot uh i think his voice sounds great on this song there's too not there's not too much like post-production stuff like layered in there i think it sounds a little more natural than some of the stuff i've heard from them um yeah man i really like this let's keep going One of my favorite things in music happens in a lot of Metallica songs, happens in a lot of really good rock songs. 
where they just cut that. It's not even like a whole measure sometimes. It's not even like a whole count. But it, where it just, boom, it just kind of cuts that, goes to silence, and then, boom, drops back in right there with the beat. Um, always, always, always appreciate that in a song. And here it works to effect. And, again, the pre-chorus is my favorite part of the song. You know, that little, like, variation in the strumming is really hitting the right buttons for me. Really digging this song. Can't wait to dig into some lyrics in a second. Little tempo change. Good bass tone right there. Oh, I know there's a solo right now and I'm kind of killing it. I might back up just a little bit so you can hear that. But y'all hear that bass tone come in right there all of a sudden? That was pretty cool. Um, I'm going to back it up just a little bit. Every time one of these songs ends, it always ends too soon. Hey, let's do a little bit of lyric breakdown. All right, looking at the lyrics here. And, you know, it says, You've wandered through the door. Come on in. Have you been here before? Waited all your life. You've come from so far away. And do you intend to stay? Uh, swim to the shore if this is what you're looking for. Shout, oh Lord, if this is what you're looking for. Um... I think this might be in reference to a relationship. Um, not sure. I, I can look at this two different ways. I can kind of see this from sort of a spiritual level. Uh, and, you know, if you're looking for some sort of like enlightenment and that sort of thing. Or just more on like a physical level. Like, hey, we're looking for a relationship. I'm looking for this other person my entire life. Um, those kinds of, of feelings. You know, I can see it says where you've been. We won't lead you astray. Share our skin. It's time for us to pray. So, again, I, I, I see how they're at some points leaning into the spiritual side of this and at others the more physical. I don't really have a lot of thoughts on the lyrics other than some sort of, like what I said, some sort of spiritual idea or some sort of physical relationship. Uh, if I'm missing something, guys, let me know in the comments. Uh, I'm sure there's something I'm overlooking here. All right, that's enough about the lyrics. Let's just get final impressions here. I think that's two really strong songs off the album. I uh, I like both of these tracks so far. I think I got to go back and listen to Fate of the Faithful and figure out whether I like this one or that one better. They're both pretty strong songs. Um, right now, I think because of just recency bias, I might say I like this one better, but I did like the acoustics in this one. Um, I like that bass tone that comes in at the end. That was pretty cool also. Um, had a pretty cool little neat little solo. Um, I do like a couple moments in this one where it drops to silence before the beat drops back in. That was really strong. Um, I'm excited. I, guys, if you're a Greta Van Fleet fan, um, I think I might be reacting some, to some more songs off Starcatcher. So, hey, give me a like, give me a subscribe, all those kinds of things. Ring the notification bell, and you can ch uh, catch the next video that I do. Guys, I hope you liked uh, watching that reaction. Uh, I enjoyed listening to that song, that's for sure. Um, 
I'll be doing some more Greta Man Fleet, I promise you. Um, this is Coach Arnser. Don't forget to be kind to one another. This is Pigskin and Poetry. See you in the next one. Bye. Pigskin and Poetry. Coach Hunter reads, reviews, and reacts.